Thank you, Chair, Madam High Representative, dear colleagues. The situation in Iran emphasizes more than ever that the Iranian nuclear program has to be addressed effectively by the international community. And let's also not forget about ongoing issues such as the permanent violation of human rights in this country. We should once again call on Iranian authorities to cooperate fully with the IAEA on all issues, particularly those raising concern about the possible military dimension of the Iranian nuclear program. This includes an access without delay to all sites, equipment, persons and documents requested by the agency. The European Union has been taking a pragmatic and straight approach when it comes to sanctions against Iran. Madam High Representative, should sanctions not deliver on their objectives, could you elaborate on how do you intend to collaborate with Middle East countries and in particular with Turkey in advancing towards a workable solution and how feasible is a direct dialogue EU-Iran? Thank you.